Hey guys, let's stick here back from the video. Today is another Skyblock episode. I have done three of them? Oh wait, no, I've done two of them. This is my third one, I'm pretty sure. So yeah, welcome to my third episode of Skyblock. I have no idea what I'm gonna do in this episode, so I need some inspiration right now. As you might have noticed already, inside my inventory, I have an Ember Rod. It's not reforged yet, but I am putting some enchantments on it. So yeah, I actually got one. Ender and I sold all of our stuffs and our chests. Stuffs. Just stuff. That's what I meant. <laughs> not that. We just got a bit more of that. But we sold a bunch of stuff. And then we got one Ember Rod. And then we're at like 100,000 coins. So we're just going to grind a bit more and then get him one. So yeah, that's pretty cool. And the other thing that the video might be titled about is I got full rainbow armor. Which is just fairy armor. This armor sucks. But look how cool it looks. Like who cares about dying over and over and over. It just looks so cool. Okay, so the real reason I'm actually using this armor is because it gives 10% more speed from all of them together, and then uh, each of them has a little bit of speed, like 5% or 6% on some of them. So yeah, I can go pretty fast, but if you watch Technoblade's newest video, this is nothing compared to that. But I made all this before uh, Technoblade's video came out, so that kind of sucks. But yeah, I just use it for the speed fast we i thought this was so fast before and then i watched his video <laughs> i mean it's it's not too bad it's a nice speed but it's not the fastest this armor does give i don't wait no is it actually that bad i think the growth is just giving me a lot of health <laughs> and if any of you are wondering how i got this armor i'll just kind of show how you get it i'll just put some music to this because it kind of takes a while to get there so there's the warp sugar island just go towards the what is it coliseum All right, I'm finally here. So, this is where I just get it. So, all you have to do is you have to have a fishing rod, and you have to reel the fishing rod. Opposite of reel your fishing rod, cast it. That's, I totally knew that word. I didn't have to uh, think for a few seconds. And you have to cast the fishing rod, and you have to wait for a fish. <laughs> okay, I know you guys are educated on how to fish, okay? I, I was just being weird. So yeah, you just keep on fishing until you get the fairy armor, and then you put them all together, and then it just kind of goes rainbow. So if I only have one on, let's see, it just kind of freezes one whatever color I want it to freeze that, or take it off. I want white. I'm really bad at timing. All right, that's the closest of white I'm gonna get. But yeah, that's what happens. And it's really good actually fishing because when you're fishing, you don't only get one thing. You don't only get uh, fairy armor. Of course, you get fish and all that, but you get titanic experience bottles like that's amazing this gives like 250 experience per one so yeah that's amazing you can get like 10,000 coins from one reel yeah you can get like a bunch of different things so it's really cool but yeah if you get uh fairy armor just try to get the full set i got um all of them except the leggings so i just bid on some leggings from the auction and i think i got it for like 2000 but yeah they do sell for a lot but if you guys, actually, by the time this video is out, it's probably gone. But what I was going to say is if you do slash the AH Zolistic, I was selling two pieces of fairy armor. Two extra ones I have. This one's selling for 4,000 coins. <laughs> yeah, I have a few things up. I have some Titanic bottles. I'm just selling, like, a bunch of things so Ender can get the Ember Rod. Because we don't want to sit for, um, for two hours. Waiting for the mob to spawn and not get it because Ender saw it at least three times so far and not gotten it because people are too good at the game. Oh, I'm going fast. We. Alright, okay, what I think I want to do right now is I'm going to try to just get another enchant on my rod here. So I think I want for- no wait, I have first strike. I'm going to go for critical, I think that's what it's called, or giant hunter. And they both have to be five and then I'm going to try to put it on this. Wait, I never saw this place. What is this? Blacksmith. Just reforging items and an anvil. Wait, they have it right here? I didn't know they had one right here. This water, some lava. I was just about to jump in that for some reason. Is there a fairy soul back here? Nope. More lava. I might have made a massive discovery. This just leads over here. What is this? Where does this go? Okay, I'm getting so sidetracked. This actually leads nowhere. I want XP, thank you. I'm not going to make you watch this for like an hour, me just trying to get to 60 levels, so I'll just cut ahead once I get 60 levels. 
Okay, that took way longer than I thought it would take. <laughs> it always takes way longer than I thought it would take to get to 60 because like, after you kill a zombie it gives you like, this much more and then you have to keep on killing them. Like what? I'm gonna kill this guy? And then get that much and then finally get all the way to there and then you're one level higher. Then you gotta do it all again you're one level higher. <laughs> it just takes so long. Before I enchant it, I need a book and then I checked on all of our chests and they're all empty because we need money and we keep on selling everything we have well for ender's thing so i'm just gonna sell that two thousand coins for that i don't know if it'd be better auctioning that but so far if i do this uh boots with uh growth five and thorns three did not get as much money as that so far put uh four thousand dollars in there take twenty dollars out buy a book and enchant the book with critical five. I think that's what I want. I keep on forgetting. <laughs> All right, here's giant killer. I'm just gonna go for giant killer. It's probably gonna be like worse than Thunderlord and I saw it so many times, so. Increases the damage dealt by 5% for each percent of extra health that your target has above you. Oh no. What has more health than me? <laughs> I have 500 health, it's not too much. Oh, I don't know if I should have done it. Now how much does it cost to put on? 30, not bad, okay. That won't take too long to get. I gotta put this in. Where's my book? Put that in. Has everything on it. Alright, and then click on it. All my levels are gone. No, I regret it! <laughs> Look at this amazing rod. It's not even that good yet, but still. It one-taps zombies. That's what my other sword did. But it one-taps them better. It does more damage, even though it's the other one one-tapped them. This doesn't make any sense. <laughs> that was another episode of Hypixel Skyblock. If you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe if you're new to the channel. Also, make sure to follow me on Twitter, at ZillasticYT. That's pretty much it. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you next time. Goodbye.